Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. Let me start tonight by asking you viewers a question. Is Lupe Flores funding the brigades or vice versa? There's no evidence to suggest that yet, but I'll keep looking. Yesterday, I had the honor to interview our Minister of Oil during the opening ceremony for a new pump. I'll show you that interview tomorrow. So tune in as our Minister reveals the secrets to our flourishing economy. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. What a relief. As you know, the Sonia show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. We count on your support. Hello, I'm Steve, owner of the Paradise Motel, where just one night will forever change your life. Now, there are rumors of a serial killer in the area, but that's just what those are, rumors. A rumor started by our rival Supreme Motel. They're just jealous of our jacuzzi. Try to avoid the cops. They're all in Tyrak's pocket.
Hey, not so fast. Sleeping on cardboard. I couldn't have that. No. Personally, I find it cozy in here. Just you and me. Together. Don't worry. I just need your help. With a little problem. Uh-oh. Could be a cop. They're patrolling motels looking for missing teens. Teens like you. Just do what I say, and nothing bad will happen. You can trust me. Get in the closet and don't make a sound. Not even a peep. sleep I've had in ages. Well, oh, you found my little problem. Good. So, yeah, I need your help with that. on the TV. Soon it will be gone. Oh, now, come on. Let's give our little friend here a nice hot bath. He could use some cleaning up, don't you think? Yeah, I bet you are. Forgot the soap. No, you don't know what kind of soap is best. Get the cop into the tub and don't try to escape. I'll know if you do. Open the door. And keep your mouth shut. Or you'll take a bath too. One more thing. 
Oh, is Jared here? I saw him get a gas can from his trunk. Oh, okay then. So, there's nothing I can help Jared with. Phew, what a relief. Oh, I see Jared's watching the boob tube. Is the reception to Jared's liking? Oh, okay, good. Well, tell me if Jared needs more channels. I can go away. Now. What's that smell? You guys grilling in there? Fine. But you don't have to be rude about it. Close call. Steve's not a connect the dots kind of guy. Yeah. Here. For helping me with my little problem. Unit 2 to Central. Come in. I'm not a bad person. That's enough. What are you looking at, kid? Ha! Huh. Yeah, right. I'm not really in the mood for a chat. But fine. Go ahead. I'm everywhere these days, including Road 96. I'm working a case that requires it. You can, but I can't tell you. Unit 2 to Central, come in. Unit 2 to Central. Hey. You gotta help me. She's taking me to the pits. Where have you been living? The Iron Pits. Where are they saying teens caught trying to flee the country? Turn around. And you, stay out of this. Kid, what did I say? Mind your own business. They're gonna send me to the pits to mine. I'll never see my family again. Of course he'll see his family. And remind me why I'm telling you this? Then why the missing teen posters? That's just brigade misinformation is all. Oh, you don't really believe that, do you? Huh? Believe what? That the teen work camp doesn't exist. Ma'am, now's not the time for a discussion. I'm just doing my job. It's time for a discussion. It's important. 
You don't seem like a bad person, officer. Just confused. Confused? Ha! You liberals crack me up. Look, this is official police business. My car broke down, okay? Kid, stop sticking up for her. Sir, leave the kid alone. Look, I've heard the stories too, but they're false. Fake news. Fake news? <laughs> I'm a mother. I'd never send a kid to a place like that. Not intentionally, I know, but you are. What did you arrest this kid for? Look, I'm not gonna... <sighs> he was trying to cross the border, okay? Then he's gonna end up, you know where. Whether you think they exist or not. That's enough, sir. Now, both of you, please turn around. Unit 2 to Central, come in. Unit 2 to Central, where are they? Kid! Citizens should be able to arrest cops, you know that? To keep them honest. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Can we pretend you, you never arrested me? Quiet back there! Actually, it's a good idea. Does anyone know you've arrested him? No, but... Now that's enough! From everyone! Please, officer. Just get off at the next stop. That's all you have to do. I'm not gonna say it again! Unit 2 to Central! Come in! Unit 2 to Central! to do all of you what's going on here he woke me up ah! Ah! whoa whoa take it easy you've crossed the line you need to this is central everything okay over you can still do the right thing don't tell them about the kid Unit 2, are you there? Unit 2 here. I just wanted to tell you I had some car trouble. I'm on the bus now. Over. Unit 2, I... I need a car to pick me up. gonna be all right, okay? You sure this place is closed, Stan? All the lights are on. Yeah, so just leave those on to scare criminals. Well, didn't work. Nope. Stan. You there. Want to be part of something big? A break in. Probably the best ever. Best ever? You say that before all our crimes. And every time, it's true. Let's talk in the back. Come on. 
time to get started. Okay, so Mitch is casing out the place. We need to be real quiet. Really? Now shut your trap. Here comes Mitch. Okay, okay. From what I can tell, the place is empty. Yeah, this should be a piece of cake. Okay, let's go. There's a psycho after Sonia, and we need to protect her. Yeah, sweet Sonia's in danger. You could say that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kid, you're going through the vents here. You use my lucky lockpick to get in. It's lucky because I've never had to actually use it. Okay, let's do this. But, uh, maybe you'd like to ask us something first? Steal as much as you can. Yeah, we do that a lot. It's much harder than you think, kid. Yeah, you have no idea. Now come here, little lady. Go to the end and use the lockpick. Now park in front of the cameras and get ready. Finally! I thought we'd never get in. Stan, we talked about this. You need to work on your patience. Kids, can you see us on the camera? Look around. See a layout of the office? Like we didn't already know that. Let's do this already. Oh, oh no, something's beeping. <laughs> it's an alarm! Kid, stop the alarm! Make it stop! Cut the alarm, kid! W what do we do, Stan? I don't know, but I can't go back to prison. Kill the alarm, kid! Kid, stop the alarm! Make it stop! Cut. Oh, thanks, little lady. Why are you thanking her? She forgot to cut it. Stan, she's not an expert criminal like us. Mitch, help me with the door. Pick it up, and that's cool. Hello, this is security. We're responding to an alert. Everything all right? Mitch, can't you pick that lock any faster? What triggered the alarm? I see. That unfortunately happens a lot. Anyway, thank you for your explanation. Just a second, ma'am. I'll also need Happy Taxi's security password. It's just protocol. What's happening, kid? I'm sorry, did you say something? What do you expect us to do? We're robbers, not wizards. No, I cannot. Yeah, whatever, kid. I'm waiting, ma'am. What is the password? Who 
Hold on. There's a prostit here. Says A45 D2R CPP12. Maybe that's it. Thank you for your time, and take care. I got it, Stan. Finally! What took you so long? You know I don't like to rush things. This is a break-in, Mitch! Look, the manager's office! Oh, man, the door is a code. Any idea? Uh, try one, two, three, four. No. Four, three, two, one? Nope. Well, I'm fresh out of ideas. Kid, you're in the security room. Code must be in there somewhere. Find it. Hold on. Try 9999. That's not it. You haven't even tried... Still not it. Not working. Still not... Wrong. <laughs> it worked! I'm in! What the heck? Kid, are you seeing this? Uh, hold on, there's tape on the camera. There! We knew someone was obsessed with Sonya, but this is Cray Cray. It's him, Mitch! The Seiko cabbie after her! You two! Stop! Close the door! Who was that guy? Looks like the security service sent an agent. Open this door immediately! Listen! You don't want any trouble! Give me the manager's office code! Don't give him the code, kid! We're close to finding where this creep is gonna attack! I got it, Stan. He's going to attack at the border. <laughs> at the top of the hill. You've asked for it. You're screwed, kid. Let's get out of here. Sorry, little buddy.